I would have never thought that this would be something that Scotty would, would do for a living. If you haven't gone back and watched some of the really old videos, I don't even know if they're still out there, you should. It was, it was organized chaos, I would say. Honestly, it's one of those where like the pregame is more fun than the party, almost. I mean, it was so fun going fishing, but the night before was all of us together. Like, you know, we'd, we'd set out sleeping bags. We would get up early, we would drive. We would usually stop at like a gas station nearby, get loaded up on donuts and all the goodies. You could feel like the energy in the garden. We were so excited. Oh yeah, look at that. We had no idea really like what kind of water to choose. So it was all just sort of a learning experience. We were not any good. I caught that one. And that's kind of the, that was kind of the picture for, for a while. And then, and then we're like, you know, we should film this. I think what was like partly special about it is it's sort of like in our like lineage. It's like in our blood in the sense that obviously going back great grandfather, like owning a fly shop. But the evolution is, it's pretty, it's, been really fun to watch and it's it is really wild when we were starting out like would not have believed it I mean it's been obviously 10 years and the common thread through everybody in this you know family and you know on this group is is the love of, of fly fishing but holy shit this is you know this has gone way bigger than we ever could have imagined This story has been writing itself longer than any other story that we've told. There are many people who have made this journey what it is today, but none of this would have been possible if it weren't for my uncle and my cousins who helped kickstart it all. As the years went by, we grew up and our lives got busier, which made these trips harder to do. Christmas was the one time every year that we'd all be together, a tradition that our two families have carried on since we were kids. And this year, I had a special surprise in store for the boys. All right, I've got one more. Awesome. Right. Uh, I'm just going to wrap it up. SK. This one is uh, from me to the Herman crew, the Herman Ooh, boys. Let's go. Oh, boys. Alrighty. So the in the past decade, fly really. fishing has made a huge impact on my life, from learning how to cast from Uncle Shock on the side of the road, and traveling <laughs> through the Caribbean, Davidson. Caribbean, whichever one you like to pronounce, to chase bonefish. It all started here in NC with you four. Growing up, our trips in the mountains are some of the fondest memories. The time we got to spend together. Scotty. <laughs> Someone else take up. <laughs> I think anyone who's going to read it is going to have the same yeah. reaction. Yeah, it does. Good luck, Dad. Uh, let's see, where are you? Together on and off the water is what sparked my interest to start documenting it all. We've gone on some pretty cool trips over the years but there's one group trip that hasn't transpired yet. So with it being the 10 year anniversary, I wanted to get the crew back together that kickstarted this whole yeah. thing. That's so awesome. That's awesome. That's Thank awesome. you. We settled on a date and location. The stage was set. And soon enough, the boys would be westbound for the 10 year reunion. Boys ready to fish? Hell yeah, yeah. dude. Yeah. Dude, that was funny. So like, fish that first day on the Davidson. Yeah. Remember, we parked in that. You guys got, did on you, that you road. Caught two it, was, fish that day. it was just. I did. It was just Adam and Scotty and I. Yeah, no. And Scotty we, and I came Scotty up practiced empty his, his cast. Did you catch a fish the, on the road? You yeah. got like two fish. I remember. You caught two so, fish, and we did not catch a single. Adam fish. and I didn't okay. even sniff a fish. We didn't sniff fish. In fact, when you caught your fish, we like ran over to like, be like, oh my god, that's a live trout. <laughs> All right, fellas, we're arriving at camp here for the this week. Is, uh, Hell yeah! Oh, I was admiring the. Uh, look at that! Camping's going on back. Oh, look at that view! That's incredible. Oh my gosh! That'll do. Come gear. check it out. Come yeah. check it out, Dick. Fully equipped. Oh yeah. Let's go. Yeah, welcome. Oh, yeah. Oh. 
Not bad. Well, 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 are we getting oh, swagged oh, out? Boy. <laughs> oh. oh my goodness. We had to Let's out here go. For these chocos. <laughs> we had to get you boys uh, hooked up. Thanks, dude. Wow. Are you kidding me? Yeah. That's real. Yeah. That's not oh real. Oh my god. Dude. Yeah, dude. Oh my oh, god. Goodness. I, I wanted to be subtle about it, but like, not. <laughs> That's <laughs> Let's go. Wow. Yeah, we got. Oh this is sweet. New waiters, boots, pants. <laughs> waiters? Goodness. Are you Pack. kidding me? Jeez. Raincoats, nets. Yeah. Fortunately, our good friends at Sims Bye. were able to to help get you guys all. Oh, set that's up. awesome! Gosh. Thank you to Sims. Jeez. Ooh. Oh yeah. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You didn't like the, the old Columbia the old man guy. <laughs> hopefully, it all fits. <laughs> yeah. Hopefully, it okay. match. Yeah. Oh, absolutely. Maybe this will help us actually catch fish. Yeah. Right. You gotta look good. Fish good. Yeah, I'm I'm sleeping in this. <laughs> let's roll. Yeah. Come on, there we go. All right, let's go. You guys ready? Yeah. yeah. Wow. This is amazing. Yeah. This well, is cool. so cool. Thank you so this, much. Like, cool way to kind of get back to you guys for helping me get into the thing in the first place. So yeah, dude, Please. this is awesome. Yeah, thank you so much. Yes. Fun to be along yeah. for the ride, for sure. Some of the OG sure. flies right here from our great 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 grandfather. Yeah, there you go. Obviously, some of these are additions, but old school. They're all flies oh. that, that uh, Pop, my grandfather, tied. I mean, he tied thousands of them. Mm -hmm. He'd go down. I mean, he'd go down the river, fish, and then he'd pick up, you know, bugs from the river, and then go back that night tie up a bunch of flies, just like those bugs, go back the next day and just hammer it. <laughs> our roots with fly fishing go back to our great-grandfather, Ralph Entwistle. As the owner of the Angler's Nook Fly Shop in upstate New York, he was a passionate fly tire and angler. He introduced the sport to my uncle, who later introduced it to us boys. You know, that was the age when I got started, when my grandfather introduced it to my dad, and, um, you know, I wanted to carry on that legacy. That was kind of the early days. Just kind of getting out there and figuring it out. We got all the boys packed in here and we're gonna get a full day of fishing in today. Should work. <laughs> Ryan or Lacker, you off the edge of this. All right, we've we've made it to the river for the day. This incredible landscape behind us. All these clouds moving through. Um, it's keeping it cool, which is really nice because it is like the dog days of summer. So we're up here at elevation. Water's hopefully really cold, and uh, we're gonna start fun hopefully finding some fish. Working with uh, very little talent. This is the JV roster. You've got uh, me, Carlos, Yo. and um, Scotty. Scotty's really our best bet here. We're gonna go downstream a little ways and work our way back to the varsity squad who has the real cameraman <laughs> with them. <laughs> um, so, you know, do we have a chip on our shoulder? Yeah, a little bit. Uh, so we're gonna go see what we can do. That's right. JV squad is coming for the varsity team. Oh!
dude. Good. <laughs> Hell yeah. yeah. Oh my god. That's a good looking fish. That's what we came for. Oh. Woo! Let's go. Bam. Nicely done. Oh, good to get on the board, and that was a that was by far the biggest cutthroat I've ever caught. Maybe the prettiest fish I've ever caught. Dude, tell me what happened. You missed it. We had uh, right behind where you were standing, Scotty. Uh, just a little chubby, a little twitch. Came out. It's hot. Hell yeah. The boys are on the board. It's the JV squad. JV squad's on the board. <laughs> Like one of the better casts I've ever seen. I mean, it was like centimeters from the bank. Eats it, sets. It kind of came back to him a little bit, but I thought he might have had him, and it just just flew out. Oh my god! All right, let him run, baby. That is a monster. That is a monster. Let's go! <laughs> Let's go! We're on the board. Oh I thought I, I thought I, blocked, I thought I knocked the fly out for sure. <laughs> Come in, team. This is Ghost Rider. Ghost Rider, what you got? Uh, what you, what we, you we, we, we're, we're starting to see some action here, guys. I don't really don't want to gloat or anything, but pretty, pretty good. Maybe a 16. It's probably it'll be 18 inches by tonight. Uh, Cuddy on the dry, both on the chubby. My dad got one just now, so I mean, I don't know where you guys are at, but we're we're coming and we're gunning. It's starting to go off here, too. Don't get, don't get your hopes up, Dave. Yeah, I, was gonna say, uh, I what, hate to what, hear what that. Hey, also, on? really bad etiquette here. I, I I haven't been saying over. Over. I get you, Scott. Way to go. Over. <laughs> All right, well, we'll keep hammering them. You guys keep hammering them on your end. Over. <laughs> I think that's all she wrote. <laughs> there it is. That was a sticky. Good fish. There we go. Sweet, we're all on the board, dude. When I cast it, it got tangled up. Still ate still it. Still ate it. <laughs> uh oh, uh oh, don't let him get hot. That's a better one. That's a really good one. Spot. It's a great hole. I I missed him the first first two times, but didn't prick him. So I knew that last cast cast felt really good. So uh, he took it big time. And then uh, we had a little challenge getting it in the net. Uh, one net went floating down the stream, <laughs> and David just about fell in. <laughs> yeah. Ripple. 
before the run. It was like right in that step at the, at the bigger okay. fish that we caught. Yeah. 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 They turned the air conditioning on the second half. Yeah, the second half. We had a good we had a good chat in the locker room. <laughs> Got a good good plan for second half coming out. Yeah. We're switching up teams. Yeah, what are the teams? I don't even know what the teams are yet. Moving out west has been a dream of mine since I picked up a fly rod. And so far, it's felt like a dream. Woo! But it's also made family trips more challenging. Pretty much once we all went to college, we all kind of spread out. It's a challenge. You get older and everybody's doing their own thing and it's fly fishing that you know, brings us all to Jackson for, you know, a fun trip. Good light. Despite the years that had gone by since we all fished together, it felt like no time had passed at all. As the day progressed, we enjoyed the remaining daylight, catching our fair share of fish. And eventually, it was time to head back to the cabin. You're like, all right, it's time for <laughs> Yeah, it's time. It's time for a hot dog. Oh, hot dog. time for dinner for sure. All right. Revolution. Revolution. Oh, right. Oh, no. <laughs> 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 Jack, it might be time, dude. I know. Did you see me? <laughs> when I, I was like reading one section, I'm just like, <laughs> it was a big day for the crew here. Oh, it was a big day for the crew. It's a, I'm, it's a good I'm night, uh, pooped. Feeling. Yeah, you might you might just sleep here tonight. I, I mean, it's gonna be difficult to get out of this chair. I'm gonna. Tell you that. It's ten twenty six, and we just finished dinner. It was a long day today, long long day of fishing. But tomorrow we're waking up and we're going floating. So yeah, we're all freaking beat from today, exhausted, standing in the sun, waiting around, and so we're gonna hit the hay. We'll see you guys in the morning. So today we're switching things up a little bit. We're heading to meet up with three of my buddies that I recruited and we're doing a float day. Um, never floated this section of the river and a couple of the boys have not floated before, right? Uncle Shock, you've never floated? First timer. First timer on the float. Looking Heck yeah. First timer on the drift boat and uh, yeah, I'm gonna show these boys the, the real float experience. So meeting up with Matt, James, and Alex at the boat ramp. And then we're gonna hit the water. Got it. What's going on? What's up, dude? James Wilson, nice good to see you, see man. You. I know. Yeah. Only yeah. took 2,000 miles. That's right, dude. Get together. Yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, man. So fun. Yeah. Yeah. made it. Yeah, how are you doing, gentlemen? James Wilson. Adam. 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 Yeah, Adam. Yeah, Nice. Good. Yeah, great to meet you guys. Feeling emotions? Yeah, I mean, emotionally, we're in a great spot. Um, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're just trying to, we're trying to have a good time, and uh, like not lose a lot of fish because it's gonna be on camera, and I won't hear the end of it from Scotty if I do so. That's the only time and you lose fish is when it's on camera. No, 100%. Uh, yesterday was a tough scene for a little bit, for a good stretch there. Um, but I think I feel like I'm going to get back to like the old days where I used to just hammer them on Wilson Creek with <laughs> woolly buggers. You. <laughs> <laughs> we 
rifle up here, looks mine. Yep, send it right there, about 10, 15 feet off it. Yep, perfect. Mend that, yep. And then pop a couple over here to that right side where it gets a little deeper yeah. out there. Got some PMDs out here. We're, Slow. We're tricking the big, uh, we're going streamer. Yes. Okay. Slow. Yes. I like it. Slow. Oh, hell yeah. Native. <laughs> She's a native. How's it coming, fellas? We're going streamer, baby. Oh, come on now. Well, one thing I would say is, you know, it was apparent to me, I could tell right off, is that, you know, the first few times we went out, you guys didn't catch anything. Look at that. Or if you did, it wasn't much, right? It's white trout. But you could not wait to get back out there. So I knew immediately the, you, you guys were into this. Yeah, Dave. If you can go out and fish, fly fish, because it's tough to learn how to do it just from the casting and where to place the fly and all that. But if you enjoy that and just being out there and, and the challenge of it, then you know I knew you guys would you would stay into it. Oh, oh the fucking worst spot there. <laughs> good stuff, Dave. Lost a good one. Giant brown, not a white fish. I repeat, giant brown, not a white fish. All right, boys. All right. We're we're getting serious over we're here. We're getting serious over here. <laughs> No more, it's, no more, no more screwing around. It's gone from vacation to business trip quickly. <laughs> yep, we've told the fish Uncle Scott's in town. That's right, new sheriff. Yeah, yep. he's in town, the fish are ready. The problem, there's, there's not a problem, but, but we need to be ready. Yep, so cool. Yeah, there he is. That's a big one. That's a big one, boys. We got a wiggler. There we go. foul hook. Yeah, foul yeah. hook. Look at Foul hook, Whitey. Can't get any leverage on him. Oh my gosh, he's just absolutely working my ass. <laughs> Can you tell us about your little whitefish clinic you're putting on. Yeah, it's, uh, it's what we came here to do. Taking them to White Town, just native city. Um, they really <laughs> like nymphs, I guess. Uh, and they really like the nymphs that I have on, I think. <laughs> they love them. They love these nymphs. And, you know, it's better than nothing. Oh, it's back, both back here. Here you go. Right. On the nymph stick. On the nymph stick. First trout. Take your cap. Nice. Yeah. Thank you, sir. Finally. Thank you. We're on Yay. the board. On the, the board. board. Do not let the case get hot. Right. Nice, bro. Ah, I thought there's only whiteies in this river. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think what really hooked us was like, we were all learning together. We would fish super hard and then we'd stop you know have a fun lunch and hang out and then we'd fish you know super hard in the evening we'd always we always fish really really hard dave was putting on such a clinic with the with the white fish it was like boom fish yep met him release him like next cast next yeah one. yeah we were trying to stick tight to some streamer fishing we pretty much streamer fish the entire thing after these oh that is a big round that's a big round Oh my god, that's a monster hook job around. That's a giant. Alright, this is gonna be sketchy. That's a big fish. Oh, it's huge. That's a monster. That's a big 
It's a good start to the second half of the day. That's what we needed. Yep, right in there. Down below the boat. Yep, right there. Let that drift. Yep, rod tip down. Keep it tight. Ah. Oh, fuck. Was that one? I think it was. Okay, get I, it right back in. We were kind of, he kind of couldn't. Oh, oh, keep it tight. Yeah, good. Yep, strip down. Oh, are you saying that way or that way? On the right side of this. Like over there? Yeah. Got it. What do you think? I think over there. Over there? Yeah, yeah. Oh, look at this right here. Fish? Oh, oh yeah. Hey-o! Hey yeah, it's a trout. Nice. Oh. Let's go. Dude, I looked away for a second. I know. I looked back. I looked <laughs> and I was like, oh, where'd my fly go? <laughs> Uh, you might have, we might have to chase him because it's still. You want to chase him? Yeah, he's just, he's in this fast stuff. I think he's, I think he's getting tired. There it is. Yeah! yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well earned fish. Well earned fish, dude. Oh, what a nice. grunt. Yeah, nice. Here, I'll anchor him right here. Fired up. Is it a cupbo? Cupbo, yeah. It's turning on. French eater. French eater. It's turning on now, baby. See ya. Yeah, yeah, it's dude, turning on, on it, boys. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Here it goes. There you go, right there. It's the money spot right there. Got him, got him? Yep, got him. Adam, baby! Don't you got it, you got yep. it. Oh, nice cutty, dude. Yeah. Nice cutty. There we go. Nice, heads up. Heads up? Yep. Oh. Hey! Good stick. <laughs> Good neck job, baby. Oh my gosh, dude. There we go. I think it's turning on a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> Baby. Oh yeah. Got him. Let's go, baby. That was the first time on the float for me, which is kind of amazing to think about all the years I've fished. Let's go, watch the head. Now lift head, lift the head. What a boy! Ah, there it is. You've been awesome. looking for that one. I mean, I just learned a ton, and um, that's so much fun. I mean, I can't wait to go do it again. That's sweet. There it is. Nice. Good. We'll let him go. Good work. Yeah. It makes you realize how much how much you didn't know. <laughs> that was epic. That was awesome. <laughs> Oh, yeah, dude. Yeah. We spotted him nice. over there. I said, you know, can we hit over there? And he's like, yeah, they're pretty. Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> sip, 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 sip. Yeah, I don't even this is like 15 yards. Oh my gosh, he's huge. I mean, he is, he is literally 15 yards. He is. You can see their back tail. You can't see them eat it, but you can see their tail. Yep, nice. Oh, 
Hop in the back. That was a good one. I don't see it, so I mean, I see it. Oh yeah, yes! <laughs> yes, that's how it's done, baby! That's how it's done! I wanna know! There we go! Oh, <laughs> Let's go, brother! Yeah! That's what's up, baby! Let's see him, dude! That's it! That's a beauty. There it is. James, my man. That was epic. That was fun. Boom. Oh my god. That's what it's that We worked for that fish. <laughs> oh god, that's a rising. monster. Yep, Ooh, that's, a, that's a big Where is he? Round. He's come up he's, like... There's one in the middle. He's out, but oh, he's oh. huge. There's a couple. I, I just saw a few. Yeah, there's one. There's one right in the middle of that of the All little right. seam there. Occasionally, oh. oh, there's one right there. You see him? No, I missed him. Really close. He was really close. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Oh my God! A little further right. After spending more than an hour trying to fool a pot of rising fish, our light dwindled and our camera batteries died. And just as they did. I hooked up on an absolute monster. Pulling it. All right, you gotta just rock it down, rock it down. Holy shit, that's a monster. You did it. Holy shit. You have to keep. You don't walk too far down. You gotta, you gotta keep him from going down there. Keep the rod tip down. And we can get out of the way. Holy shit, that's a monster. Rod tip down. Let's go see this. You gotta slide back, it's your only chance. No. I think I lost him. I think I lost him. He broke off. We're right where, where we were the last time. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah, so, uh, you know, the waterfall can't see it anymore. <laughs> I hear yeah. it, but I can't yeah. see yeah. it. You done with dinner? A couple of big steaks? No, we're, we're passing we, we, uh, no, we haven't gotten our dinner yet, but how, how much longer for you we're guys? We're pushing out now. Well, we're, we're leaving now. Scotty hooked so into funny. an absolute monster. <laughs> Took it all the way That's to the awesome. end of his line. All the way to through the backing. Yeah. Alex just had to run the pitch black. <laughs> I don't recommend that. No. To, uh, Somebody who uh, panics easy. <laughs> <laughs> but that was that was yeah. so crazy. One of the one of the coolest fish I've ever hooked, and now it's gonna haunt me until the end of time. Oh, <laughs> but sorry, we still got one more day of fishing. We got Dave and the boys on some fish. Can't see a thing. Yeah. All right, we're going here. We're we'll on the shuttle. Over and out. See you guys in the morning. We've been able to spend a lot of time you know, together fly fishing growing up. It's always been DIY, which has been awesome. No one ever was like, here's a fly rod, here's a guide. You know, it was like, we're starting with just because we're interested in catching fish. All right, well, today is the last and final day the trip. We've got one more waiting session here, a little cutthroat stream. We're all a little tired from our late fishing sash last night, floating, but hoping to wrap up the trip strong here with this last final day. The actual fishing is, is fun, um, but it's really just the banter. Adam, how are we feeling? Final day. We are dialed. It's funny because when you're on these trips, sometimes you realize like, 
a lot's changed, but not a lot's changed in, in some ways. Uh, the tendencies are still there from way back in the day. This is the most, this is the most realistic shot of, of how it used to work back in the day. Yeah. You've got me, my dad, you got Charlie, and then you got David, and he's on a fish. You All see right. him down there? there, there you no, go. he's already That's actually classic. hooked up. Yes. Oh my gosh. No, yeah, is, he's on a fish. This is the way it went. <laughs> and this is exactly what it was every time. We're still getting ready, and David's Some, way downstream, and he's, things never change. he's got the first fish in the bag. So I'm glad we got this on, on oh, camera. Oh, and look, and look, it's just giant. <laughs> Huge. <laughs> It, it's certainly something I think I take for granted. I don't even really think about it because it's just something we've always kind of done together. It's a ton of fun too. They have to be just littered with cutthroat in there. Yeah. I think the stuff more and more that, that we do these trips, like the stuff that I remember is like you're walking down to a river, you're hanging out tying flies, like those type of moments are super, super cool. You're catching up with them and you're doing something you love, right? You're doing both of those things. Yeah, it's a little back eddy, weird drift, but. So we could like hit it and then if, as it's running down, just kind of like a shoot line. Yeah. Yeah, what fly fishing is to me now, it's, it's just a common thing that we do. <laughs> How do you, your little Can you pack. imagine? Yeah, I'll do that right after the And also, I put some chia seeds in it. Tying on a little dropper and then we're gonna be back in action. Yes, there it is. Nice. Ooh. I mean Scotty's just put the fly there. <laughs> Wait about five seconds, and you will catch fish. Hell yeah, Fair dude! Enough. I'm glad. But I'm, I'm glad it worked. <laughs> Good little cutty. You take the rod. Are you that's, sure? That's the way it goes, gentlemen. This, this is All right. the sport of integrity. Enough said. I would have never thought that this would be something that Scotty would would do for a living. There it is. That's the fish. A little bit better. It wasn't like we did some videos and then we went apart and then now we're back 10 years. It's been really fun to see it like progress over time. Nice. I mean, it's been obviously 10 years and uh, he's, he was the one who stuck with it, you know, for a reason. I think my favorite part about it is seeing like how passionate Scotty is about it, how much he cares about sharing the experience. Oh, you see that? Yeah. You know, it's inspiring to, to uh, you know, to see him doing something that he really, truly loves and, and making it happen. Oh, yeah, dude. <laughs> it's not just the love of catching fish or you know, capturing of the stories. It's the love of the whole experience. Oh, there it is. Got him. Fish on. Good thing. Yeah. <laughs> now it's like 10 p.m. and we're getting off the water. It's kind of riding high, but it'll work its way down. <laughs> Fly fishing has made a huge impact on my life. From learning how to cast from Uncle Shock on the side of the road, which it all started here in NC with you four. Growing up, our trips in the mountains are some of the fondest memories. The time we got to spend together yeah, we lost. <laughs> is what sparked my interest to start documenting it all. We've gone on some pretty cool trips over the years, but there's one group trip that hasn't transpired yet. With it being the 10 year anniversary of Wildfly next year, I wanted to finally make it happen. Let's go. We got a whitey. whitey. Okay, let's move this right away.
Lapstick. Remember that? Yeah. Oh, wow. oh that's my a classic. gosh. I totally yeah, forgot about that. Oh, yeah. this one's awesome. The blonde. Yeah, yeah, that one was, one. yeah. yeah McGlone took my spot. There we go. Up in the gorge. Wildfly has grown and evolved over the years. It's taken me to places I never could have imagined, and it's shaped the direction of my life. But none of this would have happened if it weren't for a certain individual who often flies under the radar. Someone who was willing to take a bunch of kids to the mountains and introduce them to the world of fly fishing. I'd love to hear from your perspective, like what the early days of us getting into fly fishing was like and what that looked like for all of us when we were, you yeah. know, 10 so years ago. Yeah. Well, I mean, you know, as a parent, I mean, it's awesome. It's just totally awesome because you want your nephew, your kids to get into things that you like to do. And then those are things you can do together. So um, starting out was just so fun. It means the world. I mean. Now I'm getting emotional. Um, it just, uh, being, you know, being included um, with you guys. Um, it's one of those moments where you start feeling really old. <laughs> it's the old, you know, it's the old thing about the, the, the teacher becomes the pupil and uh, you know, I, I've, I've learned, you know, I started out teaching you the very basics and all you guys kind of went zooming past me <laughs> in a short period of time. And um, now, now you guys are teaching me. I mean, there's, there's so much more to, to fly fishing than when I got started. I'm just, I feel blessed to be out here, honestly, and um, to be able to partake in it and experience, uh, experience some more wildfly. So, I love it. All right, before we go, I wanted to say a special thank you to all of you. Thank you for being a part of this journey, uh, for watching our videos, for commenting, sharing it with your friends. Um, but more importantly, just thank you for believing in Wildfly. I think in a lot of ways, having you guys along with us on this journey has helped me personally believe in myself and uh, believe that this can be something and something that's real. All of this certainly didn't happen overnight and there were many, many late nights, many days of not really sh being sure why I was doing this or who I was making these videos for or if I should continue doing it. Um, and it's crazy to think that 10 years ago, this all began, this, this journey, and uh, yeah, that this, this, is, this is real. So incredibly grateful for all of you and I am beyond stoked for what the next 10 years has in store. For all of you who have made it this far, leave us a comment and let us know where you want to see us go next. You know, we're starting to plan our next year and next couple years, really. So we'd love to hear from you guys where you want us to go, where you want us to fish, where should we go tell a story. And also, if you haven't already heard or if you haven't already seen it, we've released our feature length film, Hope in High Water, which is in collaboration with our good friends at Tight Loops which is available now on our website, wild-fly.com slash movie. We've released this through a pay what you think is fair model, which means you can pay anywhere from a dollar up, whatever you feel is fair and however much you want to donate to the project. So if you want another video and you got into the end here, go check that out at wild-fly.com slash movie. A portion of our proceeds are gonna be donated to Western Native Trout Initiative, which helps protect, enhance, and restore native trout populations around the West. But yeah. That's all I got. Thank you guys again. Merry Christmas. We'll see you next year.